And I'll talk to, we know, we talk about Kata containers and now OpenStack is part of, you know, uh, Linux Foundation, Parallel Body to uh, What was the driver behind v -Node? And as you're talking about, you know, you can also talk about how the landscape of, you know, from soft to hard isolation is evolving and emerging. Obviously, there's a spectrum of multi-tenancy, right? There's really, you know, no multi-tenancy in terms of create separate clusters. Then you have separate nodes, but the control plane is, you know, run in a pod. Um, and people have done that with node pools and vCluster v and label uh, node selectors and vCluster, right? Where you can segregate things to, to different nodes. Um, and then there's obviously, you know, the very, very soft end of multi-tenancy, which is just namespaces, right? And then, you know, the traditional vCluster with, with shared nodes is somewhere in the middle, right? And the question really is, okay, if I don't want to have completely separate nodes, which is obviously, you know, costly, uh, you can't benefit from bin packing on the nodes. Uh, you probably have under uh, utilization on each one of your nodes. So how can we share a node, but do it in a rather secure way, right? Um, there weren't a lot of great, uh, you know, solutions out there that worked seamlessly in every public cloud environment uh, with vCluster. And so we decided to just uh, kind of build it ourselves and make it accessible to customers. So you can essentially see vNode as virtual nodes that automatically get created on each one of your, you know, physical nodes or virtual machines, whatever is part of your Kubernetes cluster. And we've seen people very successfully even eliminate all of their VMs in their Kubernetes clusters with our, you know, virtual stack ultimately. Uh, and that's really impressive. But uh, with vCluster alone, you only get the control plane part of it isolated. Now we also help you isolate workloads on the node level. So even stronger multi-tenancy. And can you talk about what is going to be the open source and commercial aspect of vNode? So vNode is a commercial product. It's the first time we're doing that. Uh, you know, there's there's no open source vNode uh, available. It's a private beta right now. So, um, you know, we, we're we guarding the install. There's obviously demos out there. Uh, there's uh, pilot customers who've been working uh, with us in the process. But uh, yeah, we've gotten a lot of, it's been about 24 hours since the launch. And a whole bunch of uh, requests already came in uh, for the private beta, which is really exciting. Obviously, a lot of vCluster customers, but also a whole bunch of folks that, you know, reached out and said, hey, we wanted, you know, stricter multi-tenancy. We looked into vCluster, right? But we needed harder level of multi-tenancy. Now that you have vNode, we actually want to run a POC and get this going. So it's, it's really fascinating to see the interest in, you know, just the, the first 24 hours here.